Hi, I'm Matt Atchity, and this is the Rotten Tomatoes Review Roundup for Valentine's Day weekend 2014. Hollywood's given us a heart-shaped box full of adaptations and remakes. Let's see what the critics say about how they taste. What did you do to me? First up is Robocop, a remake of the original 1987 film. Joel Kinnaman stars as the title character, and Gary Oldman, Michael Keaton, and Samuel L. Jackson round out the supporting cast. Critics are split on this one. Some say it's a lot better than expected, but others say it should still go to movie jail. Robocop is currently rotten at 49%. The second remake this week is about last night. Kevin Hart, Regina Hall, and Michael Ealy star in this sexy R-rated romantic comedy, and most critics enjoyed the film. In fact, some say that this remake is actually better than the original 1986 version. About Last Night is fresh at 68% on the tomato meter. The third remake this week is Endless Love, and it's an update of the 1981 film starring Brooke Shields. This one stars Alex Pettifer and Gabriella Wilde as a couple of love-struck teenagers that look like they walked out of an Abercrombie & Fitch catalog. Critics say this movie is as bland as the stars, and although supporting players Bruce Greenwood, Robert Patrick, and Jolie Richardson add a bit of life, critics say the film could have used a lot more camp. Endless Love is rotten at 19%. Beverly. Her name was Beverly. What's happening here? Last and least, according to critics, is Winter's Tale, which is an adaptation of Mark Halpern's novel about miracles, cross destinies, and battles of good versus evil. Academy Award-winning screenwriter Akiva Goldsman makes his directorial debut here, and the movie stars Colin Farrell, Russell Crowe, and Jennifer Connelly. Critics are pretty disappointed with this one, and many of them saying that the various elements of the film never really come together in a way that makes much sense. Winter's Tale is rotten at 8%. That's a lot of choices this week, but if you're still unsure, I have an idea for you. You can find out more about these movies, read the latest reviews, and see our own video interviews and so much more right here at RottenTomatoes.com. Tune in next week when we're going to talk about an Academy Award winner who's got a little bit of time to kill. See you next week.